Hi, I'm Zort, and you probably don't know me, but I'm an Ultimate Iron Man with way too much free time on my hands. Equipped with 2k total, over a billion items, and an opinion that nobody really asked for, I'm here to share my old school thoughts with anyone who will listen. Hey everyone, I have kind of a unique video slash announcement for you all today. As you may or may not know if you watched my Programmer Explains How Jagex Can Get Rid of Bots video, uh, I am a professional software engineer. A big part of why I started making YouTube content in the first place was to try to shine some light on the UIM community and show off some of the cool achievements that Ultimates have managed to pull off. In my recent spare time, I tried to combine those two interests and I actually wrote a bot to autonomously track and announce cool achievements for Ultimate Iron Man. And no, this bot has absolutely nothing to do with in-game bots, it's purely a Twitter bot that tracks high score metrics for ultimates and processes that data to announce accomplishments. So this here is my personal Twitter page, which you should follow for cool stuff, but let me go ahead and jump over to the bot page. Okay. So you can see the banner up at the top here. This bot tracks skill 99s, 200 mil XP milestones, front page ranks for skills, bosses, and minigames, and also boss KC milestones of 250. Using the bot is pretty simple. All you have to do is scroll down to the pinned comment here, and then you're going to want to leave a reply that looks like this. The important thing here is that you say add and then you do space and username in quotes. The username does have to be in quotes for this to work. And then go ahead and write the reply. And I guess I'll write it here. The bot probably won't reply while I'm recording this, but in a few minutes, the bot will reply back and say that uh, Zort has already been tracked. But if you aren't being tracked, the bot will reply back and say the username that you added, if it's valid, and an ultimate Iron Man will be tracked. Um, so yeah, that'll get you added to the tracker as long as you're an ultimate. And then from that point onwards, your achievements will be broadcasted on this Twitter page when you reach them. So let me go ahead and show you a couple examples here. You can see UAM Lixie achieved level 99 in fishing this morning. Congratulations, Lixie. Goose ranked 21 in crafting, got some other crafting achievements here from Bernie, nice job Bernie, Redstall, Free Melee, uh, all kinds of cool stuff. So yeah, your stuff gets broadcast right here on the Twitter page, and then the next thing I want to show you is how this bot actually looks under the hood. So give me a second to switch over to another view, and I will be right back. All right, this is the actual bot behind the scenes. You could write a bot like this in a variety of different programming languages. I personally opted for Python because I don't have a lot of Python experience and I wanted some more practice. And there are a lot of pre-existing, very useful Python libraries and wrappers that I could leverage for this bot. Let me give you a quick rundown of how this works. The bot checks for replies to the pinned comment on the Twitter page. That's number one on the left side of the graphic here. When it sees a new one, it reads the message and tries to determine if the RuneScape name that someone is trying to add is valid, and if it is valid, is the account an Ultimate Iron Man. If it is an Ultimate Iron Man, it gets added to a list of users to track. The script then goes through each player I'm tracking to pull their high score data, number two on the graphic here, and it compares it to the previous high score data, if there was any, to calculate the deltas between the snapshots. Those changes are then checked for milestones, number three on the picture. Right now I have it configured to look for when a player reaches a skill 99, 200 mil XP, front page rank for any skill minigame or boss, and boss KC milestone of 250. And then if that milestone was hit, the bot tweets out the achievement at number four. As you can also see from the picture, the script runs on a Raspberry Pi. A Raspberry Pi is basically a really small computer that just sits on my desk and is acting as a host for the bot. Someday I could potentially move the bot over to run on Amazon Cloud Hosting and that would make it more stable. For example, if my internet goes out, the bot wouldn't go down. The bot is in beta testing now, but I do have a list of future enhancements that I'd like to make after I finish working out the first few waves of bugs and get it to a more stable place. It'll also require maintenance every time Jagex updates the high scores, like when next will come out, uh, which wouldn't be that big of a deal, except that Jagex doesn't have any lines of communications to third-party developers like myself, Ambler, who made the high score Iron Man Death Announcer, 
or Ferreric of the Runelight Bot Detector plugin. I don't know if they could just add a channel in the content creator discord or something, but it would really help us with reducing downtime and getting more information about the RuneScape APIs since currently the ins and outs of the APIs are pretty poorly documented and the stuff doesn't seem to be updated consistently as changes are made over the years. I doubt we'll ever get this, but if there was also a section of the API response that tracked player drops, it would be really cool to get this added to this bot. I would love to be able to broadcast Twisted Bows, Scythes, Spirit Shields, and all kinds of other cool drops for ultimates. But again, that's just a dream, and sadly, I think we probably won't get that unless Old School decides to add something like the Adventure Log system, much like RuneScape 3 has. So anyway, I'm opening up the bot to unrestricted beta testing now. If you play on an Ultimate Iron Man and want it to be added to the tracker, go to at UIM Progress on Twitter, and respond to the pinned comment with add, then your username in quotes, like this. It may take a bit, but if you formatted your reply properly, the bot will eventually respond to you to let you know if the account was added. If you don't have an Ultimate Iron Man, but you're still interested in seeing some cool achievements from people in the UIM community, you can still follow the bot to see those broadcasts. And then for early access to cool projects like this one that I'm working on, behind the scenes, and YouTube sneak peeks, be sure to also follow my main Twitter at ZortOSRS. That's also the easiest place to reach me if you ever need to. Lastly, be sure to leave a like and subscribe so you don't miss some very exciting videos that I have in the works right now. Oh, and before I forget, a quick thank you to the owner of the Bot Detector Runelight plugin for reaching out to me and offering some helpful tips for my Twitter bot. I think it was for Eric, but I'm not totally sure. Okay, that's actually everything. Thanks for watching, stay happy and healthy, and I will see you next time.